Hello. 
What's up, Mile? Welcome back to the stoop, y'all. Welcome back, welcome back. Yo, what's up, Sun Tzu? Yo, what's up, Sun Tzu? Welcome back to the stoop, bub. Good to see you. Glad you're here. Hey, Axion! What's up? Welcome back, welcome back. Oh, it's so good to see you all. Welcome, welcome, welcome back to the stoop. Wouldn't have been the same without you. I'm so glad you're here. We're going to do some, some more spooking tonight. We're going to do some more alone in the dark. Right now I'm trying to figure out why the bot didn't post to Discord that I went live. But other than that, things are good. I did a bunch of FF14 today. I am nine quests away from starting the Heaven's Word expansion. Let's fucking go. Um, so that has been a, a uh, you know, an ongoing thing. Hey, what's up, Sody? How you doing, buddy? Good to see you. Hope you're doing well. Welcome back to the stoop. It wouldn't have been the same without you. Hope you're having a good day, bub. Hell yeah, hell yeah. I'm digging this song. This is okay. I'm gonna like that. If this came up again, I wouldn't be mad. Um, but yeah, we're gonna play some uh, some Alone in the Dark today. Uh, day's been good. Like I said, I it's been chill. It was a nice chill day. I I, I played FF14 with Vectus for pretty much all day, or for a large portion of the day. I'm ever closer to the Heaven's Word expansion. Um, hey, what's up, I Meryl? wondered! There you are. Welcome back to the stoop. Oh, there we go. The bot went live. Or, the bot posted. Nice. The bot was late, but the stoop wasn't. Hell yeah. Fire horse! Oh, it's gonna be it's gonna be a good day. We're gonna try to make some progress in uh, Alone in the Dark. We um okay, hey, check it out. I said yesterday at the beginning of, of yesterday's stream that the next game we beat would be the 69th nice game that we've beaten. And then I was so tired last night when we beat Silent Hill that I totally forgot to point that out again. We've beaten 69 games on stream. Isn't that great? It's a lot of games. Holy nice. Oh, yeah. So I thought that was a, a pretty killer milestone to finally to finally reach. I was pretty happy with that. Ah! Yeah. <laughs> Meme milestone. Nice. Wait, you can't see it. Oh, there we go. My thumb was behind Marilla here. <laughs> next, uh, next big milestone, I guess, will be a hundred. I wonder what the hundredth game will beat will be. There's literally no way to know. That's like 30 games away. I I could not tell you. Or is it 96? Is it? When do you consider SmackDown beaten, though? Like, I guess after you... Some run, viewers run, may find the following yo, video disturbing. Up, Viewer discretion is advised. Yo! Welcome back to the stoop. Good to see you, bub. I hope you're having a good day. When you finish story mode? Okay, that's kind of what I was thinking too, but... But with sports games, sometimes it's, you know... It was a shitty day? I'm sorry. <laughs> 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 
Well, hey, you're in the right place. We're gonna we're gonna have a good night. It may have been a shitty day, but we'll have a good night. Right here on the stoop. It'll be great. You're in you're in the right place. You're in a loving space. Boy. Hell yeah. Well let me uh let me uh here, let's flick it over here. I'm gonna adjust our background. It's not Silent Hill. We beat Silent Hill. Okay, also, I looked into how to get the other endings in Silent Hill 1, and I was this close. Silicide, what's up? How you doing, bub? Hope you're having a good night. Welcome back to this stoop. So good to see you, buddy. Um, We were this close to uh, getting the good ending instead of the bad ending. And we were miles away from getting either plus ending. But we were really close to getting the good ending. I just... I just didn't fully pursue the side quest in the resort area. Um, and I started it, but I didn't... I didn't know what the fuck was going on with that. And... And then the game was letting me progress, and hell, I, I went for it. But, um, but yeah, I was literally, like, one item away from getting the good ending and being, like, locked into it for sure. So that was, you know. There we go. So that was a thing. John's day before the stoop, desk chan, do uh, after the stoop, donut, yeah. Gotta see the VOD. It was really, it was really fun. I don't think you uh, hopped, I don't think we went too, too much longer after, after you, uh, left, John. I don't think. Maybe like a couple more hours. It was, uh... The ending was very abrupt. I think that had a lot to do with not getting uh the at least the good ending. I also missed out on a boss fight. The boss the final boss would have been longer, which maybe was a good thing. And also the rifle, the rifle was apparently somewhere near that giant worm fight um in the mall. Um I don't fucking no, I must have looked right at it and just not pressed X on it. I like I don't know. I don't know. Nice catch, Meryl. Um Uh yes, Psilocybe. We did manage to pull off the no rifle run. We literally had two shotgun shells to spare. Um, ammo wise and the final boss you had to use a gun on because you can't get close to it because there's like a force field so that was lucky in the end that I had enough ammo um, but yeah knowing that now I, I think I could at least get the good ending the plus endings are a little bit more I mean it's still just a matter of like having the right items and doing the right thing but it's a bit more complicated um, why is that on screen? Oh, there we go. Um. Can't believe John's day, no matter how bad, doesn't involve donut every hour. That's a fantasy. One day. One day, John. But yeah. All right. Let's, um, let's start the game. Let's do it. Thank you all for coming in. Thank you all for being here. Uh, let us not delay any further. Let us let us let us get by ourselves in the dark. Load this fucker up. I have my achievements working, so we'll get achievements in this game now too. I'll be at the top of the disc one this is a multi-disc game uh silent hill was one disc it's not very uh that's interesting 
Considering how much FMV is in that game. Uh... Okay, I think I should still have my save. Um, let me adjust the audio as I always have to do. I think here is where we liked it for this game. Achievements are on and working. Let's fucking go. Let's do it. Let's get in. My champ. It's my champ. Who's champ? My champ. That's true. Um, yeah, I guess the pre-rendered backgrounds use up a lot of space. That's fair. I didn't think about that. But yeah, this game has pre-rendered backgrounds. Resident Evil um, 2, at least, has pre-rendered backgrounds. Not 1 or 3, but, but I mean, they're all relatively short. Who just has multiple campaigns. Um, Alone in the dark. What's the, uh... Yeah. Load my save game. We had made some decent progress, I think, before finally, yeah, going to be in the lobby. Let's go. Let's do it. This music is fucking impressive already. Is this a remake or the OG? This is this is just another game in the Alone in the Dark series. I don't know which number in the series. But this game, okay. This game was also on PS2. Um and I did not know that at the time. This game sounds familiar to you, Psilocybe? Have you played this before? Perhaps? Um, this game was also on PS2, and it, like, looks pretty good on PS2 also. There are no retro achievements for the PS2 version, so PS1 all the way. But, um, I, th I thought that was very interesting. Oh, fuck. That's right. This is D-pad only. Okay. Oh, God. I hella don't remember what we were doing. Oh, jeez. How many Pokemon came out? Oh, only the Machamp and the Arcanine? Here, I'll, I'll fix it. There. Oh, I've already... <laughs> Oops. There. That'll work. Mask. Crowbar. Archibald Morton's flask. Did I do the bit with this already? Let me let me check the paintings. Where's the paintings? Where are the paintings? Are they upstairs? I thought they were... Oh my god. I am lost. Nice catch, Axion. Here we go. 
Is this open? Ah, okay. It did not save my progress in this room. Okay. That's good to know. So let's do this statue puzzle real quick. HM. And then what was the... Uh Is it just a little combination on the, the face of the, the deal here? How do I interact with this? I forgot. Fuck. There's somewhere to put in the... Um, The name sounded familiar, but you've never seen it. Was it popular? I don't think so. I had never heard of this game before Meryl suggested it. And I think Meryl had only suggested it because they knew that there was an Alone in the Dark game on PS1, which we like to play on. I don't I don't know how much more they really knew about it. Um, but I mean, I, I, I kind of like it. Like, it's pretty good. But I don't... I don't know how popular it really was. I assume not very. But I don't know. How was it that I interacted with the... I remember we unlocked that fucking... God damn, I wish... Oh, this is what happens when you take... A few days off of the fucking... Shit. Oh, 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 perfect. Oh, HM. Yes, good. Come on, go, go. H. Boom. Achievement get. There we go. It got a movie, really? That's interesting. And yeah, uh, Meryl, I, it probably was just, if anything, this is probably like a cult hit. And it probably did, yeah, like you said, well enough, obviously. But I mean, I don't know. Drag on these nuts. Aha! I got a small rusty key. Right. I think I want to go back in here. I think it was some just a sort of uncommon game style on PC, which is where it was most played. I think most of the games were on PC additionally. Okay, I see. Heard a D's nuts joke and my ears perked up. John's here for very specific things. Today I am 10 years old and mummy. Oh my goodness. Yeah, John's a John's a big D's nuts fan. Probably the biggest among us. Probably the biggest I know. Acrobat statue and a dictaphone. This is a tape recorder. 
Why are you calling this a dictaphone? This is a tape recorder. Dictaphone. If I'm not mistaken, the GameCube version is known as the best one. Really? Interesting. Ugulai Hyperhanes Kona. I have always wondered about the circle of stones located in the moors. When I would ask Edenshaw about it, he always remained very vague. I now think it's some kind of ritual calendar used to determine various astronomical events. I have started building a planetarium that will be used in conjunction with the Circle of Stones. All this seems linked to the gate, to the opening of the gate, and to the ritual of the seven statues. Ah. Edenshaw was very surprised. It seems he had not thought them related. I therefore talked him into performing the ritual of his ancestors. I know his weakness and how to use it. He wanted to convince me of his powers as a witch doctor. Even he acted out of pride. This is so weird. I recorded him while he spoke the sacred words of his tribe. He was standing before one of the steels, and the direction in which he pronounced the incantation seemed an important part of the ritual. <laughs> These nuts paleontologists. But nothing the time has not yet come, is what he said. Justify it. These now. nuts, collegiate. Why don't you pop that fucker out? No? These nuts, academic. Oh. Ooh. I don't like that. I don't like that terribly. Aline? Right here. How's it going? I met someone called Edenshaw. Now what'd you find out? He knows a lot more than he's saying. He says he's he never saw professor. Fisk, the he's friend I told PhD. you about. Uh, what do you make of that? One of two things. Either he's telling the truth, and the John said his men are nuts. total bastards, or else he's lying, which means he's just one more suspect. What if this came here, but decided not to show himself? What if he just stayed hidden? No, that's no good. I know how Fisk operates, and he would have had to ask questions. But maybe he never had time to. What do you mean? The monsters, the creatures... But Fisk died of a bullet to the heart. Oh, I see. Or actually, I don't see. I'll go looking for Obed Morton. He has the answers to our questions. I'm starting to think otherwise. Uh. What's down here? This is a fucking dungeon. Old Ben? No, Obed. Obed Morton. Yes, I do. That's that's gotta just fucking scare my 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 ass later, right? At some point. Oh no 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 no, certainly not. That crazy old hermit, never. I don't fuck with him. Good old Ben Dover. Now there's a gentleman that I can get behind. Crazy fucker he is. Old Ben? Oh, yeah. Sandworms in his asshole. How can you, uh... Can you corroborate this in any way? Any, any first-hand accounts of, of, uh... 
of his butt with uh, with worms in it. Small ew. All right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm really civil sub. I'm really happy with that one. I was pretty pretty happy with that. You were told. Who told you that, Mile? Oh fuck! Get the fuck off of me! What? Oh shit! Shady green alien. Oh, God. Tell you what. This will use keys automatically, right? No, Mile, you should just leave that to the to the professionals. Cupboard is empty. Wait, then where did I get that first aid from? I mean, that's tight, but like, what? A painting of a megalithic site with a stone cylinder at its center. That's pretty eerie, I guess. Science! I don't give a damn about science. Carnby, don't give no shits about no science. Our goal. Unidar Akam Eldrosti. Alan is so impatient. What passion and what madness. Otar and Tyron Old Bagden. Am I about to summon something? I can't get any more demons in the house. Clarity must sometimes live in darkness. For some, uh, for from darkness light may spring. Hintor Wotengar Eldrayu. It appears that the ritual must take place upon a precise date. Inheritors, guardians, rituals, date, danger. I never cease to be amazed by the richness of this language. I pity those fools who could only look on me and mock. Where do these transcriptions of Grandpa Jeremy come from? Where did he find the inscriptions? Why did he never take me into his confidence? Yeah, I know, they, uh, really like to separate their thoughts, you know? <laughs> uh, and they're not even using the backsides of any of these pages. These are all on the right-hand side of the, the book. Uh, Alan has come up with an incredible theory. I must find out if it's true. Water from a deep source revives the man who thinks he's dead. Alan was right again. I know he will always be better than me. As the text takes shape, its revelations become more terrifying. Beyond this threshold, the sun has never shone. He who has crossed it has never returned. 
This gate was built by man from Firestone so that the shadows would always dwell in night. Man sealed this gate with his blood as the gods did order him. Man has not conquered the shadow. The gate brings no victory. It merely chokes the flow. A curse on he who opens it once more. Uh, I wish there would be one in between that was just like X toy. <laughs> yeah, just a grocery list. My god, what are we doing? The last witch doctor will destroy the world of darkness. May humanity forgive us. May humanity forgive us. I got a recipe for carrot cake. Something something nice and mundane. Shadow Island. No, I'm not reading all that. I don't give a shit about Shadow Island. I'm looking for something I can use the crow bear on. I'd like to use the crow bear. The crow bear. Oh shit! Oh damn it, that was a waste. you after a night of drinking, yeah. Too busy playing with beta team forums. Missed the pocket monster too salty. What are beta team forums? What the... Oh, okay, I see, I see. Beta tester for, like, an instrument. Right on. That's cool, John. Be crawling with your head down. Yeah. The white jeans on the monster looking fly, though. You know, you gotta you gotta have stylish monsters. Otherwise, what are you doing? This door is locked. This door is locked. I have a rusty key. What the fuck do I do with it? Nope. Oh. You'll always be an alpha tester to me. <laughs> alpha test these nuts. Very good, guys. Very good. I feel like I'm like reach. Uh, <clears throat> I feel like I'm retracing through a lot of the same rooms that I went through last time we played this, but it's been a few days, and I don't remember. So good. We beat a whole ass Silent Hill game since then. This room's a fucking mess. Oh, <laughs> testies. Nice. 
Yeah, exclamation point test. Ickle. Gotta love that. <laughs> That's a classic. I always forget we set that up. Fucking suck me, you dumbass monster. This is a dead end. That's bad. What other kind of weapons do I have? Bless it, dude. Die already! Oh my god! I'm out of bullets. I could have done that the whole time. Well, you're an asshole, sir. Now I'm out of fucking bullets. Do not. Does not. Doze nut? Das, das nut? That nut. These nut. We've come full circle. This door's locked. Dat donut? That sounds good. Dem nut. What the fuck is this? That's neat. Oh no, turn that back on. Oh, I think this is where what's her name comes in. Aline? Oh, no, she doesn't want to talk to me right now. Okay. This door is locked. Oh, is there another door right there, too? Oh, fuck. I can't hop out the window. They're not. Y'all got any more? Is that it? Is that... Is that all the nuts? Oh yeah, nice. I'm glad you liked it. Not the best, but not the worst. Hey, that'll do.
I'll trade not getting a new best something for not getting a new worst something. You know what I mean? Some awesome kills. Nice. How many, though? I cannot see. Is that just a wall? That's fucking weird. Michael was so violent. He is a serial murderer. That is kind of his thing. Damn, son, I don't know what the fuck to do. Close to 50? Jesus. That's a lot. He did a lot of murdering. It fucking sounds like it. Incantation to be spoken in a precise direction. A planetarium, seven statues, a gate to open. Ended. What the hell is this place? Ow, fuck. I think the only Halloween movies I've seen are the first, the original one, and the Rob Zombie remake. I think that's it. What version is this? This is the PS1 version. Aline? Oh, hey, what's up, Tails? Welcome back to the stoop. Good to see you. I'm so glad you're here. It wouldn't have been the same without you. Hope you're having a I hope you're having a good night. Welcome back to the stoop. We are continuing Alone in the dark, it is... I am lost. I do not know what to do. Jumped back into it after a few days, and I have no idea what I am doing. Fuck me. No, not this hallway again. Favorite is Rob Zombies for sure. Side, yeah, that's rough. Uh, that's Miles' order. Nice. Uh, yeah, the third one. Because they wanted to make Halloween like an anthology series, which honestly wouldn't have been a terrible idea, but... Um, yeah, the third one. Where do I go? What do I do? Where do I go? What do I do? Fuck. Uh. 
I don't... No, I watched a video about Halloween 3, and it was, um... The villain was like... I don't remember. It had something to do with these, like, Halloween masks that they were trying to sell kids and, like, take over the world. It was kind of weird. Yeah, Mile, who's the villain in, in 3? Disappointed because Sci-Fi Channel would play all the Halloween movies in order when 3 popped up. I'm like, what the hell is this? Yeah, it kind of it kind of ends up standing out quite a bit. It was alien shit? Really? Oh shit. John's challenging tails to a to a battle. Oh. Oh, oh, the Jolteon's coming back though. I think uh I think Tails could win this. Call you Cody instead? Right on. I can go for that. All right, well, Cody and John are uh, fighting. Yeah, I super I super don't mind using people's real names. It's totally just I usually just go for usernames. Obviously because that's initially whatever I know. And then typically that's whatever people are most comfortable with. I don't know. It just depends. But yeah, if you're cool with uh real names, then I, I can do that. I'm cool with that. Wait, did we play disc or Discord? Did we play um did we play Among Us? Back in the day? I was the orange one called Funko Pop if we did. I know I played some games with uh with John back in like October, November. Really? Had to change your name to Cody Blue. Yeah. Yeah, John is Beef Supreme. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Oh, what am I doing here? No, John would, uh would be on voice back then. Yeah, Axiom is David Crane. Fuck. Oh man, I don't know what to do. Still haven't set up my new studio to support voice. You should do that. Come on, John. There were a couple, I think. Yeah, there were a couple of people that didn't use voice, but I know Axion is one that was consistent that I remember. Got caught up on them being muted. 
before I called them out. Lost the match to imposters. The last name is Wolf, which is cooler than Sergio, so I'm a wolf. Wait, I'm waiting. I'm awaiting an overhaul of my rig. One new synth before I get to it. All right, that's fair. Yeah, psilocybe, what do you prefer to go by? You realized to Derek? What? Derek? Yeah, I don't know where Derek came from. Is Wolf is the preferred thing? Okay. We can do that. I'm going to try to... I'm going to try to remember all of these. Well met, Wolf. Sodi prefers Sodi. Cool. I like calling you Sodi also. I'm down with that. Yo! Tails, get out of here! Get out of here with that! <laughs> Wait, didn't Wolf? Well, didn't you get a you get a a, a gift sub on your your other account last night? That's fucking funny. <laughs> I mean, Volcano lost dose, I guess. No. All right, Cody. That's okay. I I guess I guess stick I guess stick around. But thank you for the gift sub to uh to Wolf. I appreciate that. Related to Derek Wolf, former Bronco. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah, that was sick. Thank you so much for uh <laughs> for giving Wolf's other account uh <laughs> a sub as well. I appreciate it. Fuck yeah. Um. Sp oh yeah, spooky goal get. Yo, that puts us at 100% for the this month's goal. Thank you so much. Hell yeah. Hit the, 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 the monthly goal for subs. That's sick. That's super sick. Thank you, guys. Thank you all for subbing. Let's fucking go, Cody. Thank you. Hell yeah. Woo! Hell yeah. Woo. Also, what's up to you? Woo. Welcome back to the stoop. Good to see you. Woo! Hello, hello. Um, we are playing Alone in the Dark. I am lost. I do not know what to do. Yeah, big woos. Big woos. What the fuck, dude? Let's go, me. That's so much. That's a lot. That's, that's so fucking much. Bruh. That's a lot. I'm not giving you any goddamn Pokemon. <laughs> fuck. Ah! Thank you. Thank you for the 2,999 bits. <laughs> oh my god. That's fucking insane. Cody, Jesus Christ. Thank you for the fucking just extreme amount of support. Blue badge. Oh my god. Blue badge. That's... Oh my god. <laughs> I think, uh, I think you are the second person ever to get that badge. Debring, uh, longtime community member who we don't see as often anymore, who I mentioned last night, being the other person. So that's fucking cool. I should probably get uh, a 5k bit emote then. I don't have one. I should make one or, or get one. Debring pops in and out. They, they, they tell me good luck a lot. Or they used to. They they were around a lot, like, back whenever I first started streaming. Yeah, the blue looks really good. It goes with, uh, it goes with your name. That's very nice. Very, very nice. Drop all your lures. Drop your lures. Let's go. Oh, my gosh. Cody, thank you so much. Absolutely, you're, you're super welcome 
uh, here at the stoop. It's been great having you. I'm really, really happy. To, <laughs> I'm really happy to have you as a part of the community. It's been really great having you around. And here's to having you around a while longer. Um, fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. There's, there's that. I'll cue that up. That should, I think that'll pop after the, after this one. I don't know. If not, I'll, I'll throw another one. Um, oh my goodness. Yeah, John throws his, like, as soon as he gets, as soon as he gets here. Pop, pop, pop. All right. Let me, yes, now back to game. Oh my gosh. Fucking, I don't know what to fucking do. <laughs> I'm so lost. I, wait a second. Y'all see that on the floor? Is that just, oh, that's nothing, okay. God damn it. Ah. Oh, fuck. I didn't mean to do that. F. There we go. Yo, Sam! Welcome, welcome, welcome in. Welcome back to the stoop. It's so good to see you, Sam. What you doing? What you doing swinging through those trees ever so very slowly? How you doing? Hope you're having a good night. Always good to see you, my friend. Yo, Cody, congrats on the on the fire pup. On a on a on a fucking roll. Trying to catch this Growlithe. <laughs> Cody beat you to it. Heard Growlithe was originally going to be a legendary. I think I've heard that too. Or or at the very least, I think maybe Arcanine. Right? Like the evolved form. That sounds familiar. Come here, mime, you fuck. You fuck. Catch Mr. Dot Mime. Don't click that link. There's no telling what it is. Arcanine was going to be the legendary? Nice. Do you have to put the dot in Mr.? for it to work. And then the space, too. Maybe I should try to go back outside. What items do I have? What items? What documents? Some cool art of Arcanine, yeah. Where do I go? What do I do? Check this fireplace. I am at a loss. Uh, 
What in Hades? Oh, jeez. My god, I would have been better off just starting over. I don't have any ammo. I don't know where to go. I keep fucking walking back and forth through here. Liked Golduck's screen time in the show. Did he get a lot? No, this is Alone in the Dark. Uh, this is Alone in the Dark, The New Nightmare. It is another uh, survival horror PS1 game. I, go through here again. I don't fucking know what to do. I am giant lost. Character development for the Golduck. That's cool. Catch Jolteon! I see that, Sam. Just yelling. Missed your constellation. Jolteon's your favorite electric type? Really? I don't know what mine would be. My favorite Pokemon is Blastoise. No contest. Son, this shit blows. Special attack and speed are more th or through the roof. Blast cannon, though, for uh, for Jolteon. I can get behind that. I like anything that's uh, values damage highly. Oh my god, this is just this note again. I don't need this. <sighs> oh my god, another one. Avkanis, Amerindians, a link between two humanities. Oh my fucking... God, all of this. All right, we'll 
is log that. Um, what are you, the currently available puzzles or whatever? I don't fucking know. What things do you know of that need interacting? I can't find anything. Yo, congrats, Sodi, on the Kabuta. Uh, Kabuto. Yeah, Kabuto. Um, but yeah, Meryl, I, I don't know. Um... The last thing I did was open the, it was that. And then whenever I opened today and loaded in, that was, wasn't done. So it like had saved, I guess the beginning of the room basically, whenever I used the save charm. So that's once again, the last thing we did. I feel like I should have used the crowbar already. It opened... One second. It opened this painting. It opened the little slide on this painting and gave me this rusty key. Ooh. Which looks like one of the small keys Chris would use in Resident Evil 1. Fun fact. I've interacted with doors that have been locked, none of them have worked. It may not be... Oh, it's... I didn't read that. I didn't read that. Away! I can't get over. This door is sealed up. Dead. Crowbar? Oh, wait, it is sealed rather than locked, right? I see where your head's at. I see where your head's at. No. I think keys will auto-use if I use them on the thing that they're for. But I don't know about the crowbar. Um. Oh, you know what? Anything else in the room? Um. No, I think I need to go. Now that my attention is, like, drawn there. I think I need to go left. I think we need to go two doors down.
Oh, that took me all the way up to the attic. Hmm. Horsey the dragon Pokemon? What? Horsey's not a dragon Pokemon. He's a seahorse Pokemon. It's this whole bit. Oh, I see. It evolves into Kingdra. It's really? Why is it known as that? Like, even if Kingdra is a dragon type, why would. That's fucking weird. Yeah, Meryl is the clear Mon Master. Because shut up, Chris? Okay. Fair enough. That's a good reason. Buena, 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 buena. Scyther the bug dragon Pokemon, yeah. Trying to make sense of why the creators made it dragon type. Same creators who made Snake named Ekans and a Cobra named Arbok. Yeah, I mean... I don't know. Still. Still. I'm unconvinced about the Seedra. Say Evans? Oh, it said Evans. I still read it as Ekans. Name my next Ekans Evans. Yeah, that's kind of how the Pokemon's whole bit. Arceus Legends will introduce a different version of this guy's evolution. Scyther? Really? I do in a manicure. Nice. Sounds good. Type blah. This is the new evolution. Oh. That looks stupid. He's got axes for arms. 
He's like a little rock knight. Is Scizor an evolution of Scyther? I thought they were separate Pokemon. Is it an evolution? Really? I thought they were separate things. That's crazy. Scizor is Metal Scyther? I see. Well, now they're making Rock Scyther, and it looks bad. Yeah. Big axes for arms. Needed to evolve it with Metal Coat? I see. Metal Coat. I see. Okay. <coughs> F. Big axes for arms is dumb. Me looking at Scyther with blades for arms. Okay, but... There's just something about the, like, particularity of, like, axes for hands. It's, like, it's really goofy. <coughs> you don't think it looks bad? That's okay. Oh, my God. I am... I am mad lost. I think I might need to peek at a walkthrough just to get like a line of where to go. Just so I can get on a line of like, cause I just don't know where I'm at in the game. You know what I mean? Um, nice catch, Sam. The axes wouldn't be dumb if it looked cool. It looks stupid. That's right. Everyone already has a sand shrew. <laughs> Looks kind of cool, TBH. I don't know. It's not like the worst, worst thing, but I don't really care for it. Hot take, Pokemon ha was always dumb designs. Yeah, but are they dumb designs or are they dumb designs? You know what I mean? Like Blastoise is dumb. So it's a, it's a certain, you know. As a big Pokemon fan, that's truly the reality, yeah. Blastoise is offensively dumb. You're offensively dumb. They're dumb. Some look cool and some don't. That's also true. Name name a cool looking Pokemon that isn't Blastoise. Uh, I'll wait. Rock Scyther is plenty dumb looking. Absol. Next. Pokemon Salamance? Salamance is cool. Salamance is a cool looking dragon. I can't think of what an Absol looks like. Shiny Umbreon. I like that you specifically went shiny. There's dumber looking Pokemon in each gen. I mean, yeah, for sure. Like, I'm not saying Rock Scizor or Scyther, Scyther is the worst thing ever. I don't even, like, hate it, hate it. I just don't think it's very good. I even maybe, like, a part of me kind of likes it because it's pretty, pretty bad. Pretty dumb. Absol is the white furred one with a blade on its head. Oh, yeah, that one's all right. That one's all right. You're right. Um, doesn't make me like Rock Scyther. <laughs> Shiny Mega Gengar. I do. I. I don't know. 
<laughs> Lunatone. Dunsparce is pointless. Melodic. I can't even think of these Pokemon off the top of my head. They might grow on me because I usually think newer Pokemon look dumb and then they grow on me. Yeah. That's kind of my deal, too. God, what the fuck do I do? I did it. I did it. I, I did a thing. I did a thing. I fucking put water in the flask. I don't know what that did for me, but it did. I, I don't know. Yeah, I only know Pokemon like I know Gen 1 pretty well. I know Gen 2 okay. Gen 3 and 4 I still like like, but I, I kind of start to fall off. And then Gen 5 and onward, I'm like, I don't know. There's a couple of Pokemon from Gen 5 that I like. but Like Haxor, I think it's called. It's a big fucking Godzilla dinosaur thing. Play Pokemans Go occasionally. I haven't played Pokemon Go in forever. I thought about Pokemon Go today. I saw somebody on TikTok that was messing with it. There's a new Ponyta. Alolan Grimers. Couldn't tell you. All right, what did filling that up with water do for me? looks like a My Little Pony. That ponytail looks like a My Little Pony. Oh, you literally said that. Yeah. Axion, same page. playing Pokemon Snap more than anything. Haven't played Go since like 2016. Yeah, same. Doesn't even look Pokemon anymore. It is cute though, yeah. Nothing wrong with feminine tastes. I hate it, but it's cute. <laughs> uh, you meant Muck instead, Wolf? Gotcha. I still don't know what it looks like. In the Alolan variant. Alright, I filled that up with fucking water. I filled that up with water. And... Now... Oil slick. F minus. Oh. 
God damn it. dying, but I won't lose, like, hardly any progress, so that's, yeah, that's fine. Pokemon is a dumb design. Golem. Golem is maybe the laziest design I've ever there they've ever done. Rock with lizard limbs and head. I think the evolution chain into Golem is like super fucking weird. Just Legend of Zelda Turtle Rock. For a game that was made by someone who loved bugs as a kid, I wish the bugs were more of a threat. Dude, I, yeah, more, uh, more, I, I hate actual bugs, Ugh. but bug Pokemon are neat. And, uh, yeah, bug Pokemon get no respect. and dugong also very lazy there's a lot of gen 1 designs that are literally just an animal or a large animal or a small animal yeah literally Meryl yeah B drill gets scary really I wouldn't want to like like walk outside and like see a B drill in my like on my front porch I would go the fuck back inside Yeah, trading to evolve for anything is bullshit, in my uh, opinion. They were patterned after actual animals. I mean, yeah. But still. A heart that's also a fish. Ashler and Beedrills were assholes in the first episode. Yeah, they like attack him, don't they? He gets he gets attacked by like Pidgeys and Fear or er, and Feroes and Beedrill. I think it's Feroes in the first episode. They fuck him in, in a Pikachu up. But like right after they meet Misty, they get fucked up by some Beedrill. Also, all kinds of shit fuck him up. Ash sucks. What a what a chump. What a scrub. That's my point. Everyone is like Gen One. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, <laughs> when it's really plain for a lot of it, just caught a ton of people at the right time, and then when st they started experimenting and getting weird with it, those people complain. I mean, yeah. The honeycomb Pokemon confused the heck out of me. I don't even know what you're talking about. Yeah, that's true. At least they're not all just animals now. I don't know. I think Gen 1 has the appeal of that simplicity to it. 
so the weird ones stand out a lot in the in Gen One, and then and the weird ones are cool. Now there's like a lot of weird ones, and they're like kind of whatever. I don't know. It's I mean it's always a mixed bag. Pokemon is always a mixed bag. Every generation is a mixed bag all the time, forever. Is there Gen 1 pandering from Gen 6 onward? What do you mean? Combi is a bee, but also a honeycomb. Dedeni? Deden? What is that? That is an off-brand Pikachu. I don't know how to say that. Sick of seeing Charizard? Oh, I see. Comfy is my least favorite design, though. I don't even know what that is. I've been wandering around these same rooms for a long time. I super um, don't know what to do. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna see about switching games. I'm, uh, oh, whoops. I'm not sure what to do here. I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna hit Vectus up this about, uh, playing some Phasmo. And we'll, uh, we'll go from there. I don't know what the fuck to do in this. I have been wandering around for over an hour, uh, over an hour, and I'm tired of it. I don't know what to do. This door's locked. Then unlock it. I am beyond confused. I got the rusty key, and then and for what? For what, dude? Like, I'm probably not even gonna save, because the saves are limited. Which, like, whack. Shout out to Silent Hill for having unlimited saves. I saved, like, 50 fucking times yesterday. Um... Whoops. There we go. Let me... I just want to check one thing. And then I think we'll, uh... Just switch it. Cody, you, l you literally didn't miss anything. <laughs> I mean, other than some, like, Pokemon t conversation. As far as the game goes, you didn't miss shit. Do a Pokemon tier list sometime based on design only. Okay. That's actually a good idea. Yeah, I've been trying to think of That's a good that's a good suggestion. Yeah, I was thinking, yeah, just one gen at a time. Yeah. That would be that's a good idea. And then if we do by design only, I can I can do all of them, even the generations I haven't played. That would be that would be cool. But yeah, I've been trying to think of um, other tier lists we could do because the tier list streams are really fun. Why Poke Lure Redeem Limit? I'll be out of points in five minutes. <laughs> Cause you, you, you know, I, I don't know. I think the reason I put the limit on it was Meryl said to put a limit on it because otherwise they would uh, end up with a full dex after like a day. Because some people have like essentially infinity points at this point. <laughs> so. 
Okay, I just want to check down here. Yeah. Meryl could redeem like 600 times on their own. Axion could redeem probably like a thousand times. Reset everyone's points, increase the cost, no limit. Yeah, that'll, 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 nah, yeah, yeah. That'll go over real well. I think three was a good choice. If mostly everybody uses up their three, it adds up to a lot of chances. Yeah, see, that's what I was thinking also. Even three, three ends up being a lot throughout the stream with everyone redeeming. Yeah, and then that plus the uh, every 15 minutes, it, it's a... Uh, you end up with quite a few Pokemon to throw at. And then I throw uh, quite a few super lures at you over time. So I think the uh I think the Pokemon economy is moving at the exact right pace that it should. The Poke economy, if you will. Poke economy with the little accent mark over that first uh E. <laughs> no, there's no, um, there's no microtransactions for Pokemon. God damn, I don't know what to do. All right. I think... I think next time we play this, I'm either A, going to peek a walkthrough to get back on track, or B, just fucking start over, because I don't think we're that far into it anyway. Um, because I am fucking fat lost. Holy crap. Let's, uh, let's switch over to the stoop. Observe this all-out brawl between Meryl and, and Cody. Um, yeah, I'm big lost. All nuts tier list. <laughs> Can I save this? Can I fucking... Can I, like, bookmark it? I guess I could just bookmark it. Like, actually. Yeah, right. That's that's true. There has to be more than, what, two, four, six, eight, eleven nuts. There's way more than eleven nuts out there. There's got to be. Rank the nuts based on design only. Um. Okay, let's... Let me see. I am rank 7,588 on Retro Achievements. I'm back in the top 8,000 after our uh, getting 25 achievements in Silent Hill uh, yesterday. I'm in the top 22.15%. How about that shit? That's great. Um... Let me here. I'm gonna turn on some music for a second. We're gonna we're gonna switch gears. We're gonna switch over to some Phasmo. Yo, Cody. Yo, yo. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Um, let me, 
Give me one second. I'll get that up there for you. Excellent addition, Cody. But the moon continued to fall. Uh, that's really good. Here, I'm just edging him up a little bit. The margins are like a lot wider than the actual image itself. So. Bong rip time. Hell yeah, brother. Make him small behind the stoop gang sign so the beam is almost touching. Okay. Here, I probably need to flip him around, right? Wait, hang on. I can't put him behind the stoop gang sign. Because the stoop gang sign is a part of the actual background. Oh, okay. I see what you mean. Here, I'm going to flip him. Extend the beam. Um, that. Yeah, that would be handy. Just like a, a, a wee bit. For the, the scaling, I guess. I don't know. How does that look? Does that look all right? Loving the DeVito? Yeah. He's the trash man. Honestly, that looks kind of okay to me. It's very it's very subtle. It's very subtle. That is Paul Wall. <laughs> yes it is. Could be can it be a tad bigger? Um yeah. Like that. See, but then the scaling is weird because he's in front of the sign. I mean, I don't know. Not that it really matters that much. Paul Wall, baby. Tilt him? I don't have I can fully rotate I can only rotate him at 90 degree <laughs> angles in a uh, in OBS. Yeah, I don't have to tilt. Oh. What if I just hang on, hang on, I have an idea. What if I just made the moon this bulb? Right, okay. And just stay with me. Stay with me. Stay with me. Let me line that up just right. Hang on. Stay with me.
and then flip my guy. Okay. I know, I know. Okay. Now we got And let me go ahead and put this guy on the right layer. Because you got to have your boys on the right layer. And then we... How's that? Yeah, fuck the bulb getting in the way. Consume thy bulb. I think that'll... I think that'll work. I think that's just big enough to, like, give the right idea. Is that a slightly longer beam? <laughs> or is it just... Is it rounded off a little bit? There we go. I changed it. If you can uh if you can tell. Hmm. That is not the real Ray Mysterio. No, that's it that is uh that is Sodi. That is the great grape Sodi in the Luchador mask. Um, oh my goodness. I love that. That is a fantastic touch. Holy shit. I really like that. <laughs> That's, that is really quality. Oh my god. Oh man, this stoop is just coming along so just miraculously. It's really fantastic. I appreciate all of your fine touches. Uh, they have been applied with incredible grace thus far and continue to be so. Um. <laughs> Fuck me, I love that. Okay, I'm gonna take a short bathroom break and run and grab a drink and message Vectus about Phasmo. And then we are going to segue into that. So stick around, we'll be right back. <laughs> That's something. Oh, awful. Look at this. It's got little swivel doors. Oh, I broke it immediately. I'm... But every time Axion's name pops up next to a fucking link with a clip to me... I know that it's me doing something fucking ridiculous. <laughs> I can't get this bag open! Like, Jesus! Come on! I don't want to rip it open and the fucking Legos go everywhere. Like, what? Is this Fort Knox? Like, should I go from the other side? Evidently. <laughs> Fucking losing it, folks. You're getting the it, like he walks right in front of it, so it's not very hard. And you can walk pretty freely around here, thanks to the the, uh, the disguise. I he said, and then bet she thought I was gonna miss it. You thought? Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. Yeah, I got those PSG-1 Trank bullets, though. Oh, fuck! I only ran into one mine, too. Only one. Just one. Oh, fuck. Oh, only two. Only two. All right. I think this is the way out. Nailed it. Oh, wow. Get a load of this guy. 
And this guy. Are you, uh... Oh my god, they're enemies. And my monkey has just abandoned me. <laughs> Cave boy. Oh. Mm, looks like this is a... That's a drone, uh, or a camera. No, no, that's a guy. No, that's Olga. Or no, that's the president. And then, yeah, down there. All right, I haven't played this in... 